who yeah. sees something serious happening, yep. realises no one else has noticed, abort it straight away. We can always talk about it later, but if it's serious, like the, like the hook's caught onto a mooring line or something, or, you know, from the chopper, we cannot have the chopper attached to the boat at any time. We regularly train with helicopter crews. If you're on camera, mate. Yeah, well, I need plenty of footage. Helicopter. Malulaba Rescue that is behind us, uh, leaving harbour now. Malulaba Rescue is tasked to exercise with the chopper crew, while Rotary 3 is in a supporting role and on standby should an assist be needed while we're training. Just like Coast Guard, our ACQ Life Flight Choppers need to train regularly and join with us two to three times a year so that we can get used to working together. The main difficulty is communication. The helicopter's rotors create a lot of noise and downwash, making it very difficult to communicate with them over radio. Often we need to resort to hand signals to get the message across. Halfway through the exercise the chopper replaced their crews so that they all gain experience of piloting and dropping their swimmer onto our boat and practice these skills. After a couple of hours, our skippers and crew also get a good feel of what is required of each of them. All the better for us to work as a team when we might be needed to handle a real emergency. At one point in the drill, Rotary 3 was sent back towards Majimba Island to investigate the reporting of a lost line overboard. On completion of this exercise, Malulaba Rescue returned to base for a well-earned lunch and debrief.